In eDiscovery, and primarily in document review, your ability to efficiently and precisely develop your case determines your success. In a previous session, we took a closer look at Xero's advanced analytics and their ability to empower legal teams to perform seamless analysis directly within the review tool itself, helping decrease search time, increase quality, and minimize overall review costs. Xero Advanced Analytics also includes our unique patent pending exemplar custom find similar functionality. That's what we're going to take a closer look at today. Exemplar enables users to collaboratively create a customized perfect document as a model or exemplar, providing users with more specific and higher quality search results, resulting in fewer false positives. So we take a look at my demonstration database here today. We can see exactly what it is we're looking at. Now the content of this database is made up of animals, uh, basically like a series of encyclopedic entries, everything you need to know about them. People tend to inherently understand the difference between a dog versus a fish versus a snake versus a bird. And let's say I came in and I found this particular document that was of interest to me, this Anatolian Shepherd Dog. As I come over and take a look at my similar concepts, we can see that there are 16 pages worth of results in this particular database. 16 pages worth of dogs. And again, these documents talk about uh, what they eat, digestive system, where they're first domesticated, crop tail, short hair, long hair, how they are to train, um, all of those good things. But this is where one of those issues in around the notion of false positive steps in when you start talking about similar concepts, because this is done at a document level. Essentially everything on all four corners of that document make up all of the related concepts within it. Hence, when you're looking at material that has other things referenced within the document, you oftentimes get back a large result set that isn't exactly what it is you're looking for. So let's say, for example, I could care less where these dogs were first domesticated, uh, what they eat, all of those things. I'm looking for a very specific type of a temperament. And I happen to see this paragraph right here. It tells me this Anatolian was developed to be independent and forceful, responsible on its own for guarding its master's flocks. These traits make it more challenging as a pet. And it finishes off with a line here. They've also been known to kill bears to protect their charges. Well, let's say that particular paragraph is the only thing on this document that's of real interest to me. That's right on point with what it is I want to look for. That makes it a perfect example to add to an exemplar. Now, because an exemplar allows you to create essentially a perfect document where we get to remove out all of that extra noise that gets associated with these documents, all I need to do is come in and give my document a name. Essentially, these are all a blank slate. I already have a protective herding dogs one here I'm going to work with. And then I fill in the details. What actually makes up the content of this document? Again, pull out all of the extra stuff about uh, what they're like to play with, about uh, whether or not they have cropped tails, etc. And essentially, I can cut and paste that paragraph and throw that in here. Works great as a collaborative tool as well. Other members of your team may have rights to create and work with and build upon these exemplars. And maybe somebody else saw in another document this single sentence that fit exactly with what it is we were looking for. It could be very aggressive towards strange people and dogs, needs careful handling and training. Maybe one of the attorneys on the project that has a very good understanding of the case wants to sit down and describe, freeform type in, their perfect document, what they hope to find or hope not to find within the database. Essentially, the key here is that it allows you to pull out again, all of that information that can muddy up your search. And as I go and I run this particular search, run that exemplar and say, now find me everything that is similar to this. As opposed to 16 pages worth of results, I get a grand total of 51 records. Again, much more targeted and focused to what it is I'm looking for. I want to bring this over and look at it for a little bit of context. We can see, as opposed to the poodles in my database, I get back results like my Barca wall, which tells me when I look at it for some context, famous for the ferocious demeanor and loyalty, rugged, courageous, it's a resilient working breed, commonly seen following large herds of goats and sheep during migrations. Again, doesn't mention the terms watchdog or guard dog, but conceptually, that's exactly what it is I'm looking for. More importantly, I get back results like my Bisbin. And when I look at that for some context, again, powerful and ferocious, primarily uses a flock guardian and herder, Oh, also makes a good watchdog and large game hunter. It picked up on that notion and to kill bears from the original document 
and again brought me a much more targeted focused result set. Again, simple, intuitive use of analytics with the ability to more effectively target the information you're after. All from Xera, a platform that works the way you think.